new game. The embrace. My whole life. There was a um, tutorial, but that's all boring and stuff. Two days. Two she was a kid and shit. So. Two days, and I'll know who she was, and why I was cast out at birth. As if there could be an excuse for that. All right. I'll just turn the. Uh... Oh, never mind. You can't turn up. I'll just turn my TV up. <laughs> Time to gather the parts for some fire arrows. I should find a herd. I've got a short one. Oh, hello there. I shot you in the face. You didn't do a shit. I just want to go about my day. Boy! Boy, I will cut your dick off and use it as a dildo. Look at me, I'm floating. I can't hear anything. Nope, not a thing. Oh yeah, we have this focus as well. This game's about mother's heart. Like, dinosaurs and shit. Two more days, and I'll know what it's like in there. It's so many people crammed into one place. I guess no one ever gets lonely in there. Hmm. Mother's watch. That way. Mother's heart. This way. I can go this way. Check out the metal shower. Oh, there. I'm gonna take on my first like full fo full focus battle. You're scanning for me. You just got boppity, buddy. Oh, I'm good if I. You really have to know how to aim in this. Oh shit! I'm good. You really know how to. Aim. You really have to know how to aim in this game. Because if you don't know how, then you're just gonna die. Could easily die. My. But let me not. Oh, it's square. I forgot. Oh, it's square to slide as well. Let's go. Didn't know that. Oh, no. Didn't mean to do that. Didn't mean to do that. I'm gonna hit the quick, quick save on him. I'm gonna hit the quick save on him. Start. I don't see what damage is to that building.
tear apart. It's quicker but harder to um just straight up go in there, just not even care about anything. It's harder but it's way quicker. It's just not boring. I want to watch the video. <laughs> oh. I know later in the game. Oh, oh, you just got that. That boy's lit. You know, lit. You're a thick lit boy. <laughs> I did not mean to set my fire, but meh. Can't waste those arrows. We need them. I don't know why. I think it's for the proving. It's, it's like the trial. Are you okay? Matriarch Lanzara was right about her. She doesn't have any respect for the tribe's leaders. The old man is outcast. The fuck you say, man? I don't think I'm allowed in there. I think I might die if I don't come in here. Just because I'm shown doesn't mean I won't pass through. Oh. Never mind. Just because I'm sure it doesn't mean I can't Time to see cars and get a trip caster. Exit. Oh wait, no, that's an exit. No one else around. Looks safe to meet. My guess is he'll be waiting for me. No, I don't think I think we wait for him. Oh, he's waiting for us. There he is. Yeah. He's nervous. Well, well, well. An outcast on my doorstep. All mother protect me. Surprised you saw me the way you keep looking every other direction to make sure no one's watching. Careful there, or you'll sprain your neck. It's always a pain in the neck when you show up, girl, one way or another. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> when I visited, you had a trip caster available for trade. Still got it? 
I do. But you'd need to bring me a scrapper lens. What can I say? Special weapons don't come cheap. Oh, I can pay. Took down a scrapper not long ago. Stripped out the lens in perfect condition. I'll be the judge of that. Show me. Boy, shut the fuck. Boy, if you don't get your humpty dumpty looking ass, boy. If you don't get your humpty dumpty. This is what it looks like, guys. It's a bit like a shark wire. Shark wire. See, it stops them. Because the machines, it kills them, I think. I think I got your hump to dump to look ass over here. Hump to the dump to look ass. Now that you've got yourself a trip caster, practice how to use it someplace else, all right? My life's exciting enough without a bunch of shock wire booby traps to trip over. Really? Could have fooled me. <laughs> Is there a reason why you're acting so cranky today? Once you run the proving and get made a brave, you'll deal with traitors in mother's heart. Maybe I don't like losing customers. Traitors who don't break the law and deal with outcasts, you mean? That's right. Our days of crime will be behind us, so long as you keep quiet. Are you worried I'm going to tell someone that you trade with outcasts? I don't think you're the kind who talks, but you never know. You can stop worrying. The secret's safe with me. Yeah, that's what I figured. But I don't mind hearing it. The only person I've ever told about our trades is Rost. Yeah, well, not like he can turn me in even if he wanted to. Law and duty sort of a man, that Rust. I don't know how you stand it. You really don't know why he was cast out? I've told you no. I don't think anyone knows what he did, but it must have been serious because his term is for life. Why do you take the risk, trading with outcasts? Every time you ask. If a big, meaningful talk is what you're after, move along. It's because you used to be one, isn't it? Yeah. Got caught poking around one of the metal ruins out beyond the embrace. Matriarch said I was tainted and gave me five years. What did you see in the ruins? Nothing I can make sense of. After my shunning, I tried living back in Mother's heart, but... Everyone I knew had moved on, and there were so many people everywhere I turned. I like it better out here. Will you be around later, in case I want to make another trade? I'll be here. Uh, same as usual, bring me the parts you harvest from any machines you hunt. The better the parts, the more shards I'll pay. Uh, be sure to take a close look at my inventory, though. Who knows? Maybe I've got something that could give you an edge in the proving. Get out there. Uh... You already got a lot. Really good bow, you got cautious language. So hard to don't to look at. Do 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 do. Guys, I'm getting these because I got the complete thingy. Complete, um... Always a pleasure doing, but I guess that concludes our. All right, good luck. I've got what I need. Time to meet Rob. I've got the complete edition, so I've got all these. That's pretty good, actually. That's really good.
Usually the three I do. These balls actually fight you, it's so annoying. Well, I'm sure they used to anyway. Shrek. 
Tasty. Oh, my Oh yeah, this comes with an important part other than the tutorial. It's like an introduction to the game. Um, this this boy, because I'm an outcast and they're the Braves or the Noras. Um, he threw a rock at my head twice, and um, what? Because I was a little kid. I think his name was. Uh, Basta or Basti? Basta? Basta? We all need braces. Can't be just one machine. And, um. Aloy, you're here. And. He threw a rock, obviously. I threw a rock right at his head, we had a choice. Where are you no, brute force? No, no. It's not getting any warmer out of here. Uh, and um, I chose the brute force option, but um, Rust shot the arrow at this guy. So I mean, shot the thing at this guy. We should talk. And um, <laughs> and um. That's really hey, it. Moral come later. You're here. You have the firearms. I do. Those explosions and shouts beyond the embrace. Is that the trouble you were talking about? You will know soon enough. Until then, we wait for dark. Wait for dark? Look, Rost. I've thought it through. And I'm not going to shun you after the proving, okay? I'm just... I won't do it. I'm not about to pretend that you never raised me. Aloy, the law forbids all contact. It does, and I don't care. I know what duty means for you, Rost, but all tribal law has ever done for me is take things away. And that's not gonna happen again. Aloy, I must obey the law. And so you will. I knew you'd say that, so this is what we'll do. I'll come to you in secret. No one will see me, so I won't get in trouble. A and I know you won't talk to me because it's against the law, but I'll talk to you. It'll be my crime, not yours. You'll just listen. And that's how we'll handle this. You've put a lot of thought into this. I know. So you can stop worrying. It's handled. Yes. So it is. I don't understand. Those explosions are outside the embrace. What can we do from in here? The lesson will be taught in due time, Aloy. Till then, we wait. I saw Karst and got that tripcaster I was talking about. I hate to think what that outlaw traitor charged for a weapon of that make. It wasn't cheap, but the caster is worth it. Perhaps. You'll know it's worth soon enough. Still a while to go before dark. I guess I'll get some rest. Good idea. There'll be no time for sleep tonight. Anymore. Oh my God, it's 
some who are shunned reaped honor before disgrace. So much for tribal law. I spoke to no one, and now we must both keep silent, for we are outside of the embrace. These are the true wilds, Aloy, with threats unlike any you have ever faced. That carcass. What sort of beast was that? The tribe Soldiers. comes with a sawtooth, and it's something new. Something angry. Since they first started appearing ten years ago, they have killed many braves. Yeah. Follow the path. It's not far. That cabin. What happened to it? A machine, that's why. What sort of machine does that? The sort of machine you're hunting, then. I'll watch your carcass. I'll harvest the parts. Watch your surroundings. This map is huge. It takes so long to travel around and everything. farther now. Why are we the only ones out here tonight? Why can't the tribe's braves hunt this machine? They did. The kills we passed are theirs. Tomorrow, they will hunt again. They want me to. This machine will be my kill. Or your death. <laughs> be careful. Yeah, I died a lot on this uh, thing. Even on easy, it's pretty hard. If you didn't know how to play the game. I didn't the first time, but I've played a lot of it. An entire lodge? Wrecked? By... Sawtooths? How many were there? I didn't bring you here to answer questions, Aloy. I brought you here to deal with that. Shaken trees, alright. I'll deal with shaken trees.
Hop, tu danses. Tu danses. Why did I bring you here? Not to answer questions. Aloy. Survival requires perfection. It was a test to hone my skills against a dangerous new machine. Oh. Follow. Wait, what? Aloy's wrong. Oh my god, how are you wrong? You're like the smartest outcast of the model, and obviously the best. These are Nora hunting lands. They must be protected. If you hadn't destroyed the Sawtooth, how many Braves might it have killed or injured tomorrow? The lesson lives within the question, Aloy. For years, you've trained to win the Proving, but only for yourself. As a Brave, it will be your duty to fight for your tribe. My tribe? You said I wouldn't need them. But I never said the tribe wouldn't need you. The strength to stand alone, Aloy, is the strength to make a stand. To serve a purpose greater than yourself. That is the lesson you must learn. And remember it. After the proving. And after I'm gone. I really want to spoil it, but... Follow. Can't. I got right to the proving something really... Important happens. Gone has passed. This will be your last day in the embrace as an outcast. Use the time to set your mind on the challenges before you. Nice. When it is time for you to go to Mother's heart, I'll be waiting for you along the I'll go back to the cabin with you. I'm not heading there just yet. I have other plans. Oh, such as? I'll be waiting for you when it is time. I understand the final lesson, Rost. Do you? But if I'm going to stand for something, it'll have to be something I believe in. Then I hope you find it, Aloy. I hope you do. I'll see you at Mother's Heart, then. You will. She falls off cliff. <laughs> I was literally a yeet off her cliff. Imagine. That'd be funny. Good for an old remedy. It's so hard to dump the things. Okay, 
ました。うん、さあ、さ
thought to leave that. That'll keep my stomach quiet. I was really bumping in that way. That one up smuggly wobbly. Louder than I expected. I've never been so close before. I guess everything's bigger up close. Soon it'll all seem familiar. Like home. I don't know about that. Look for High Matriarch Tirsa. She'll help you. Any other concerns? What should I expect once I'm inside? There'll be people celebrating and feasting, more than you've ever seen in one place. No other village compares to Mother's Heart. It is the seat of the High Matriarchs, a center of Nora life, a jewel of the sacred land. Give it time, and you'll grow fond of it, as I was, back when I was at the tribe. Are you sure they're gonna let me in? Told you, Aloy. By law, any child outcast can run in the proving. And any who pass are made braves and are outcasts no more. I know that. But not everyone follows the law like you, lost. Have faith, Aloy. The tribe will honor your right. Any final lessons before I head in? No. You've learned every lesson the wilds have to teach. It was you who taught me, not the wilds. Not sure my bow and spear will be much help in there, though. It is with bow and spear that you'll win what you've wanted all these years, Aloy. Answers. I'm ready to do this. See you back home in a few days? You will not find me there, Aloy. Here. Take this, too. Remember. Why are you talking like we'll never see each other again? No. No! You should be with the tribe. And I will always be an outcast. But I told you, I have that figured out. I'll come to you in secret. I'll be the one breaking the law, not you. You don't even have to talk to me. This attachment to me will only hold you back. It's my wish that you embrace the tribe. You've lived in isolation long enough. Until now, I didn't. For your sake, I must go where you will never find me. This... This is goodbye. No. It's not. You taught me how to track. Wherever you go, I can follow. Not this time. This time. And every time. I'll be wearing this when I find you. May all mother bless you, Eloy. And you. First, the proving. After that, I'll see where his trail leads. <laughs> Ooh. 
What the fuck? You will turn back, outcast. Or bleed. Your choice. Make way! Make way! Braves, stand aside. She is welcome here. Mother's heart is open to you, child. Come. I assure you, most Nora aren't so rude as those idiots. You're Tirsa? <laughs> Who else would I be? Come on now. I've been waiting for this day a long time. You have? Oh, yes. But for the moment, I must leave you. I have other outsiders to keep safe tonight. You what? Envoys from another tribe, the Karja. Come to observe the proving, and oh, how the Nora hate the Karja. Karja? But that's my problem. We will talk later. In the meantime, enjoy the festival. Oh, down the path to the right, you'll find an old friend who can't wait to see you. But I don't know anyone here. <laughs> Try telling him that. We will talk later. May the goddess protect. What is going on? I know who is. I know who our old friend is. I want to dance. Turbo. Big boy too. Yes, Teb. It's you, isn't it? Over here. It is Aloy, isn't it? I'm remembering your name correctly? Are you the old friend Tirsa told me about? I don't know you. I see you don't recognize me. Well, it was a long time ago. Teb is my name. You were half my size when you saved me from a herd of machines. I remember. You tried to thank me. I never forgot that day. All these years, I hope to see you again. If you came to run in the Proving. As you can see, I didn't turn out to be much of a hunter. I served the tribe as a stitcher instead. A maker of garments and armor. In preparation for this day, I've made an outfit for you. I hope you like it. What's it going to cost? Cost? <laughs> Nothing. Consider the thanks I tried to give years ago. Long overdue. <laughs> His arm was really good. But like, I could easily get no protects a light. And like, that's way better. Seems to fit you perfectly. Uh, thank you, Teb. I've never had anything like this before. Well, it's yours. I think you'll find it affords more protection than what you were wearing. Every outfit offers some advantage. It's always a trade-off. Anyway, I shouldn't keep you any longer. Head for the Matriarch's Lodge if you want to find Tirsa. You'll know it when you see it. A large wooden building with an angry mob waiting outside. Tirsa said something about envoys from another tribe? Yes, that's what the mob's angry about. Karja visiting our sacred land for the first time in years. I'd expect to see some tomatoes fly, maybe rocks. Hopefully not spears. In any case, be ready to duck. Be bringing me another brew. Something like this. 
Everything's so loud and happy. I just hate calls. I just hate bells. Get down from there! Bat it up, you're drunk. Why do you have to go climbing houses? Oh, not supposed to go climbing on other people's roofs, huh? Get down from there now! Oh, that's just what you want, isn't it? For me to fall on my head! What I want is for you to climb down! What you want is for me to have no fun at all! Fine! Stay up on the roof all night! Yeah, I will! Yeah, I'm drunk. Doesn't matter. I'm still climbing. Oh, what an idiot he is. Every year this happens. Every year. At least he's not trying to run a brave trail. <sighs> she can't see what she to do. I'll climb so far up she can't see me. <laughs> Listen carefully now. I've been up since early in the morning. I can barely think. Who claps better than Listen carefully now. I want to dance. But you'll have to tell this when I'm gone. I wasn't drunk when I ran the proving. I'm out of one. I heard he'll I love him him. Him. But not with his girl, but her sister. Imagine. They're really good. <laughs> yes, he is. Every year this happens, every year. At least he's not trying to run a brave Listen trail. carefully now. But you'll have to tell this when I'm gone. In the beginning, all life came from all mother. People, machines, and beasts, all were her children. They lived alongside each other in the comfort of her wild embrace. But some grew restless. Though they took of her bounty, they wanted more. These were the faithless. The machines had whispered to them, promised to serve them, to make them a new world, better than the one all mother provided. A world of metal. They told the faithless they huh. would do all nice. work for them. My mother's Feed them, dead. shelter Ooh, them, give them a life of ease. Plenty. So, Aloy, over here. Karst? What are you doing here? Careful. Pretend like we've never met. I wasn't supposed to trade with outcasts in the wilds, remember? How could I forget? And how generous of you to talk to me now. Don't be like that. You know I'll be rooting for you in the proving tomorrow. Can't wait to see the looks in some of these faces when you win. And if you need any last minute supplies, uh, I'm your man. So, Mother's Heart, I thought you preferred the wilds. Well, man can't drink alone all the time, can he? Truth is, I get lonely once in a while. There, I admitted it. Don't think less of me. I won't hold it against you, if you give me a discount. <laughs> you can't be. I'm joking, Karst. It's good to see you. <laughs> Don't go soft on me. All right, let's do this. Um, uh, uh, See you later, Karst. Good luck. We shall bless the proving. But first, we have guests to welcome. For two years, we have been at peace with Akarja. It is time to restore our bonds of trade with Meridian. These envoys come to us under a banner of peace. Peace. It's peace. 
<clears throat> an annunciation of gratitude written Killers by the and hand slavers. of yeah. Sun King yeah. of Killers our and slavers. Hey, hey, Luminance hold your mind. fruit, nor, uh, nor a faithful. Hold your fruit. Now, I'm Azaram, not Karja, so I'll put it just straight. The 13th Sun King was a murderous bum. Oh, he was. He was a tyrant and a monster. He raided my tribe for blood sacrifice, just like yours. My own sister was taken. I hated the Karja. But the 13th King is dead. Two years now. Who killed him? The 14th. Not because he, he lusted for power, but because someone had to put an end to his father's atrocities. Yeah! yeah. The message that this poor priest means to read is an apology. Straight from the lips of the 14th king. So please, can't you lend him your ears? So I'm close to three and frozen to them. Thank you. <clears throat> an enunciation of gratitude. Written by the hand of Sun King Avad, 14th Luminance of the Radiant Line. <coughs> People of the Nora, on the I eve of your departure, know that the Karja stand with you. He's wearing a focus, just like mine. You're the only other person I've ever seen wearing a focus. Where did you get yours? What? A Nora? Wearing one of these? That's impossible. Your tribe fears the old places, forbids them. Who says I'm like other Nora? Why, well, uh, I guess you're not. Maybe you've gone delving in the ruins of the metal world. What's wrong? Apologies. Uh, a malfunction. Oh, Lynn, you making friends with locals, are we? I'll. I'll come back. Wait. No. Uh, we'll talk later. Have to go. Whoa. Well, I guess he's more hungover than I thought. <laughs> hey. You got the same trinket that Olin has on his head. Since when did those become fashionable? His name is Olin? Who is he? And where did he get one of these? Ah, he's just a scrounger with friends in high places. Now he spends half his time digging for artifacts, the other half drinking or dicing. As for the trinket, well, I guess he dug it up somewhere. Just a weird old jewel he sticks on his face. I mean, no offense, it looks great on you. I've never seen armor like yours before. You've never seen Vanguard steel? Now let me introduce you. Ring locked, impact protected, sturdy enough to choke a sawtooth. It has to be. The Vanguard of the Sun King's best. Life takers and machine breakers to a one. We might even give them Nora Warmaid like you more trouble than she can handle. <laughs> With all that metal to slow you down? I doubt it. Yeah, hard to say. From where I'm standing, looks like a pretty even match. I thought your friend was gonna go down in a hail of fruit, but you really calmed the crowd. Uh, thanks. I, I wasn't sure I could do it. The Nora is still pissed with the Karja about the Red Raids. And who can blame them? What else do you know about Owen? Well, is he really that interesting? I'm starting to get jealous. Well, he scours the wilds for ruins, digs up stuff, and sells it to nobles. When he's not scrounging, he's scouting. Exactly the skills you want the man guiding your expedition to have. I've known him for a few years. He's a loyal companion, cares for his family, holds his drink well enough. I like him, but besides that, not much to tell. I should make my way to the Blessing. Yeah. Look, maybe I shouldn't say this, but... It's obvious that you don't belong in this backwater. I mean, you're smart, you're obviously capable, and... Well, I mean, look at you. Uh, what are you talking about? You know what. All right, if you ever visit Meridian, look me up. I'll show you around, make introductions. It'll be a whole new life, if you want it. I'll even introduce you to my sister. She's got more connections than I do. 
I thought you said she was captured and killed by the last Sun King. Ha! <laughs> captured, yes. Killed, no. That takes more than a few cards to finish Ursa. She got away. Now she's captain of the entire Vanguard. That's quite a story. Maybe I'll tell it to you sometime over a drink. Anyway, I have to go to that blessing thing, too. So, uh, see you around, maybe? I won't let the cart of Faithless stop me from enjoying the festival. What harm? Oh, if you don't get your home to dump Aloy, take your place right there. The prayer lantern is yours. I made it for you. Blasphemy, sisters. Aspirants, before each of you sits a prayer lantern crafted by your mother. In her honor, light it's flame. In honor of Rost. And all he did to help me get here. Oh, Mother, hear our prayer. prayer. What is the child but a mother's hope that takes flight? A glowing flame that climbs the air, set free to the wind, sailing the sky till it fades and falls. So, from one to another, passes the chain of love. Mm-hmm. Okay, buddy. Of course Boss is gonna win. Just look at him. There's Owen. I have some questions for you. Boss, that was no. Uh... Aloy, now that the blessing has been made, you and I finally have a moment to speak. I hope the ceremony wasn't too unpleasant for you, given your circumstances. I can't say it was comfortable, but I could see the beauty of the ritual, even so. It takes a generous heart, Aloy, to commend a ritual that venerates all that you were denied. All I'm saying is that it didn't bother me. I have bigger things to worry about than hearing the Nora mumble about their mothers. I see. I imagine you must have questions for me, then. Why was I made an outcast at birth, Tirsa? What crime could I have committed even before I was born? Aloy, this is not a question I can answer. Why not? It's simple enough. And what about my mother? Is she here tonight, watching me? Or is she dead? Is she here? Or nowhere? I am sure your mother is here with us, if only in spirit. <laughs> That's not really an answer, is it? Just so you know, Tirsa, the reason I'm here is to get answers. Real ones. And when I win the proving, I will demand them. I know, Aloy. I would expect nothing less. What about Rost? Why was he made an outcast? So, he never told you? He said he swore an oath never to speak of it. Yes. As did I, and the other matriarchs. I'm sorry, Aloy. But Rost's past is another secret I must keep from you. What else is new? <laughs> I should be going. I'm sorry if I've been too harsh. 
It's just... I've wanted answers for so long. I know, child. You're not the only one who's waited years for this day. I will be praying for your success. Hello, Owen. You know my name. Ah, guess Aaron told you. Why did you act so strange when we spoke earlier? Must be this festival. I'm really not one for crowds. Maybe I should just turn in. Stop dodging my questions. All right, cool your fire. I got nothing to hide. I've never seen anyone else with a focus. Where exactly did you find it? In a ruin. North of the claim. That's our name for the Asaram homeland. Up there, the metal seams run deep. Steel giants half buried in loose soil. Forgotten caves that the old ones bored into mountain rock. Your eyes just lit up. I found my focus in a cave just like you're describing. A ruin of the old ones. If you've delved yourself, you know as much as I do. Go to those places for answers. Not me. When we spoke earlier, you winced, then looked like you were in pain, or frightened. Did your focus show you something? It didn't show me anything. I told you. It malfunctioned. Happens all the time. You're not a very convincing liar. Do you always accuse people you've just met of lying? Only the ones who aren't telling the truth. Fire and spit, girl! I'm a plain hammered man with nothing to hide. You don't believe me, that's your trouble, not mine. What are you doing here, Owen? Why come to Noraland? Aaron needed a scout for his expedition, and a second for his drinking, that's all. Someone to stop the Sun Priest getting lost. When all this is over, I'm back to delving ruins, rummaging for scrap, scrounging up trinkets to sell. So you're an explorer? Just another Outlander, girl. A man's gotta make his shards. I just make mine in service to the king's court. That's all. I don't understand. We have this device in common, but you can't wait to stop talking to me. <sighs> I already have all the friends I need, girl. I don't need the bother. I'm used to being shunned by the tribe. I thought you'd be different. It's nothing personal. It really isn't. You should... Try to enjoy yourself tonight. Big day tomorrow. Always best to make every day count. <sighs> last, last, last. What about Vala? She's strong. Whatever happened, blood of a I know I lost beside my mother among the current. Jobs in the head, what the fuck? Well, jump into the bag. Yes, the jobs in the head. Yeah. Find your pet outcast and dream of winning the proving. That's the closest you're gonna get. Oh, this is the bed house? With you standing guard? I figured it was the latrine. You were, you were very present here. <sighs> hmm. Well, well. Look who's come in from the wild, the motherless outcast. <laughs> I see you've still got a scar from where that rock I threw hit you. Now that's a cherished memory. You can be a real lard sometimes, boss. Cut it out.
Aw, you even try to dress like a real Nora. Not that it fools anyone. So this is how it's gonna be with you, is it? This is how it's gonna be with everyone, outcast. You belong in the wilds, not Mother's heart. And you definitely don't belong in the Proving. The only way you know how to feel strong is to make someone else feel weak. It's not working. <laughs> I've trained all my life. You'll see tomorrow how strong I am. Oh, I've seen plenty. You grew a man's body, kind of. But down deep, you're still a scrawny little brat. You know, I often think of the day I gave you that scar. It's a cherished memory. You should cherish it. If Rost hadn't shot my stone from the air, you'd be missing an eye. But I suppose you leave that part of the story out when you tell it, don't you? I branded you that day to mark your shame. All you did that day was make me stronger. Just wait. I'll show you tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, right. This is boring. Time for Boss to get some sleep. You'll be the one surprised tomorrow, outcast. Not me. Oh, are you gonna shut your mouth? Because that would be a surprise. Uh, Leave me alone. Is. I just want to get some rust. Nice job handling Bost. That should keep him quiet. Till morning, anyway. I don't believe we've met. I'm Aloy. Oh, I know who you are. The competition. The others, they'll finish the proving. Most of them. But win it? That's down to Bost, you, or me. Vala. Nice to meet you, Vala. You're right. I am going to win tomorrow. Never celebrate a victory before it's earned, girl. My mother taught me that. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm gonna get some sleep. I plan to be well rested when I run you into the ground tomorrow. <laughs> Your bunk's right there when you want it. Okay. Thanks. So, your first day in Mother's Heart. What do you think? You've never slept in a Nora Lodge before. Not very private. It has... certain charms. Homey enough, once you're accepted. That's the problem. I think you'll find a place here. I do. Get some rest. Ready yourselves! What will it take to get... One sec, my phone just takes me. You out of here. Looks like a grazer!
shattered, outcast. Looks like you'll need another. Dead last, girl. Might as well walk from here. Boss will win, Urvala. But you'll be made a brave so long as you finish. Oh, now. That's an old trail. Two died on it last year. It's falling apart. Better dead last than dead altogether. Whoa, 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 whoa! My old mother, are you crazy? You're gonna kill yourself! It doesn't get any easier! You're insane to go that way! There's no way but forward Just now! Stop right there! There! Just Gotta catch up! Turn around and climb back up! Who's in the lead? I don't wanna do this! Girl. I can't see! Boss, we'll follow right behind you! Come on now! Stop dragging. We've gotta keep going. The outcast. On the old trail? Is she crazy? Good. I'm gaining. Look! The outcast is catching up! How'd she get up there? This is gonna be close. Oh, I'm on Ayla, you're going hard. Hurry, keep at it. I forgot to make that jump. They had a tribe, but I had the wilds. Precision, not enough. Must be perfect. Then beat me now! She didn't win! The outcast cheated! An outcast? Win the proving? Never! For she is a brave now. You did it. As are you all. So long as you put your trophy on the altar. But it is Aloy. Once outcast. And now brave. Who is first among us. Ah! Keep them pinned down till the others arrive. We can't stay here. That's the way out. But we will make it under fire. They can't. 
can't shoot if they're dead. Keep them busy. I'll find an angle. Fast! Fast! Are you with us? I'm with you! Let's go! Now! Kill them! Too many of them! We can't win! Kill them all! No witnesses, no survivors! Don't give up! Oh no! There's more! They keep coming! Oh, this is coming just not in the middle. We're down, but we're not out. Descend while we have a chance. We'll jump off the cliff. Oh. <laughs> he brings up the minion.
Hold on. He did slide up, I don't know. Just the uh... Oh, that's not what I was talking about. She should be near her mother. Those are gone. Where's my focus? It's here. Okay. Wait. Am I in 
inside the sacred mount, but only matriarchs are allowed inside. I, I don't see my bow here. Or that damaged focus, the one I took off that killer. Where are they? I'm picking up some kind of signal. Looks like the ruins I fell into when I was young. The Nora didn't build this place. The old ones did. But why? There. With the rest of my things. You are awake. You brought me here? Quickly, you must follow. To where? To the place where you were born. Are you saying I was born here? Inside the mountain? It is easier if I show you. She had a thing that's called the Womb of the Mountain. The um, name of the quest. You'll see why it's called that soon. Why did you bring me here? It seemed you were dying. And to die near one's mother is sacred. Landra, you <coughs> spoke with me. Is my mother here? Am I going to meet her? It's complicated. Please, just follow me. Does my mother look like me, but with short hair? I don't see how that could be. You were not born of a woman, Aloy. The mountain is your mother. Um, what? what are you talking about? Come. The Great Chamber, where all mother slew the Metal Devil and gave birth to you. Aloy, the Proving Massacre was just the first of many disasters. 
The war party we sent after the killers was ambushed and slaughtered. But what does that have to do with where I was born? My hope is... everything. This is where we found you. We heard your cries, came to look, and there you were. Just... just lying there? Yes. You mean I came from behind the door? Always that is what I have believed. That you came from the womb of the mountain. A gift from all mother herself. But others, like Lansra, feared that a darker power put you here. Not a gift, but a curse. But I don't even know yet. Yeah. This isn't a goddess. Aloy! It's a door. With people behind it. My mother? <gasps> oh. Hold for identity scan. The goddess speaks. Just like the woman I saw. Alpha registry corrupted. Identity cannot be confirmed. Entry denied. No, no. Aloy, all mothers spoke to you, as if she knew you. Were you not listening? It didn't recognize me. Because of corruption, the goddess's own words. Surely, if you heal this corruption, she will see you clearly. And how would I do that? You said you've had visions. Of a woman with short hair. The killers came for me. Because I look like her. But their power is overwhelming. Is there no other trail to follow? Oh, no. He was one of the outsiders. The night before the proving. The killer saw me through his eyes. He lives in Meridian. So you will have to leave the sacred land. I've been an outcast all my life. Why not an exile, too? There is another way. Come, and we will make it so. You said the tribe was on the brink of extinction. What happened? After the massacre at the Proving, a great war party was sent after the killers. Less than half survived. How was the war party defeated? The killers do not fight alone. Somehow they have a power over the machines, corrupting them, driving them mad. So the killers got away? Yes. And now the only plan my sister matriarchs can agree to is to sing to him of atonement and beg for all mother's mercy. As though she would not want us to help ourselves. Then, what's your plan? This. This was my plan. To show you where you were born and loose you to follow the destiny all mother intended for you. The other high matriarchs are waiting for us. Let me do the talking. It is done? Yes. I showed her. Sisters, the goddess spoke to Aloy. Told her to heal the corruption. Ha! But how is she to do that? She will have to journey beyond our sacred land. A seeker? If the goddess spoke, it must be so. You would name this thing a seeker! Sister! For once, Lanzra, join with us. This will be your sin, not mine. Send her seeking, and may she never be seen again.
grace of the One Goddess, we hereby anoint you a seeker of the Nora tribe. No barrier can now stay you from your sacred task. May all mother protect you and sustain you. Stay true. I will make ready for the hymn. Our hopes lie with you. Tirsa, what's a seeker? You are. And here is your mark. In times of great need, the High Matriarchs may anoint a seeker. A worthy brave sent forth to accomplish a great purpose. No matter where that purpose might take her. Even beyond the borders of the sacred land? Yes. And with the right to return when you are done, or as the need arises. Have there been other seekers? There have, but they are rare, and most who set out are never heard from again. Was Frost a seeker? No, not a seeker. What are you not telling me? This is not the time, Aloy. Perhaps another day. What was done with Rost's body? I'm afraid there was very little left to recover. <laughs> but what there was, we buried at the place where he raised you, with flowers on the grave. Thank you. So I can go anywhere at all. No restrictions. Even to forbidden places, like the tainted lands beyond all mother's sight, or the ruins of the metal world. I see. I think I should go to the boss. I should be on my way. No, I didn't get to the From boss. From here, you must go to, to the, the gates of the embrace. And this. Speak to Varl, and he will point the way to Meridian. If any Nora tries to stand in your way, Aloy, Make sure they know you are a seeker. Oh, I will. Thank you, Tirsa, for all you've done. May all mother bless you and watch over. Nora Faithful, we will soon begin. I spent some time Purify your hearts. We have soon we will beg forgiveness for the sins that brought such misery on the tribe. God is the outcast girl. We are your faithful so children. She's the fighter. Will you show us mercy? Will you sing the hymn of eternity with us? She saved many lives. The tribe is lucky to have her. Lying steady as a drumbeat. Need the gate opened. Then you'll have to talk to the new war chief, Rush, up on the wall. No, not that. Okay. This is my ship. I'm a secret bit. I'm a secret bit. I'm a secret bit. Continue the report. There are rumors of a demon loose in the embrace. A thing of dark metal that corrupts every machine it touches. Where did it come from? They say it broke through the gates of the embrace. Who is... I need the gate opened. 
<laughs> Since when has any outcast's need been my concern? Since I was anointed a seeker. Now open the gate. You? A seeker? Have Tissa and Jezza gone insane? Bad enough that they let you run in the proving. But to nurse you back to health inside the sacred mountain? <sighs> no wonder a curse is upon us and children lie dead under cairns of stone. And where were you when those children were being slaughtered? Or the war party ambushed? Guarding your little gate here? I am the Nora War Chief, and this gate is Mother's Watch. I have been anointed a seeker by the High Matriarchs, so do as I say and open the gate, or we will settle this in blood. The sooner you're gone from here, the better. What was that? Oh god, this stupid boss again. other machines what's its secret how'd you do it show me <laughs> you made them obey you but how this you did it with this it's <clears throat> connecting to my focus then I could use this it's worth a shot a couple loops of wire Looks like it'll hold. I just need to test it. <coughs> I 
How did you do it? Tev? What are you doing here? You're a stitcher, not a brave. I came to help defend Mother's Watch. But I never imagined I'd see anything like this. You killed that demon. Pulled its guts from the carcass. The way it controls other machines. I think I figured it out. But I need to test it on a machine. Uh, plenty of striders along the path to the gates of the Embrace, I guess. Exactly. And the gates are where I'll be headed anyway. I need to speak to Varl. I always knew you were different, Aloy, but... But what? I think you're a blessing from all mother. No matter what Ress says. <sighs> Thank you, Teb. But I have to go now. I know you do. And my thoughts go with you. I think it's a bit weird. He was like... Hey, oh, like 12, 13 years old. Didn't know that. I don't care if you have to bandage it together. Get it done. Um. They were. We met him. No space. Earlier in the prologue, like the story, the start, the tutorial, and he was like a teenager, and we were like five, six, or seven, or something like that. And he's kind of hitting on me when he's like, like, Ray. I'm young, like, chill, buddy. No, I'm way younger than him. Gates of Mother's Watch crushed to splinters by a demon. Be gone, outcast. They all would have died. I need to test this device to see what it can do. Help. You're the one who survived the proving. Yes, I do need help. Ten years ago, my brother was cast out. His sentence ended, but he didn't come back. His camp was empty and covered in blood. You, um, you said your brother's camp was soaked with blood? The Braves went looking for him, and that's what they found. All I can think about is what might have happened. Is he really dead? Or maybe just wounded? Is he suffering? Does he need help? I can't stand it not knowing. Why was your brother cast out? Rome was always a little different. A little touched. One of the hunters had a cruel heart and never let him alone. I was gone but an hour. The hunter said after him like always, but this time, Brahm struck back with a rock and split the man's skull. Spirits made him do it, he said. 
Whispers of the Forgotten. It cost him ten years. I never should have left him alone. What are you doing out here all alone? Each day I cut a notch on the wall so I knew Brom's sentence was over. Then I cut three more. But he still hadn't come back. I begged the matriarchs to send braves to find him and all they found was a blood-soaked camp. The braves said he must be dead. But I have to know the truth. So I came out looking for him. I'll do what I can to find your brother. Well, then let me come with you. I won't be a bother. I know how to stay out of sight. I'm faster on my own. If that is how it must be, just find him then. Please. Alright guys, that, that sounds like a good spot to um um sit ball. End it end it off. Alright, never mind, we'll do this. Alright guys, that seems like a good spot to... Oh wait, never storm this time. Alright guys. This seems like a good to end of rest of them this room alright so um, bye guys bye bye